If somebody's into something, I feel like they should have the support mm. for whatever it is. Oh, because then they will get good at it and have a life of it. If they're just always told they can't do, they're going to have the confidence. I feel like lockdown really made people just realise like how much fun they have playing music. And they're like, you know what, I'm going to go for it because yeah. I mean the world's just going shit. So I might as well just have fun. I wouldn't ever say to anyone, oh no, don't, don't trust the like, don't trust it. You're not going to get anywhere because if someone's having fun. So it's gonna have fun. I definitely wouldn't have thought this time last year it would be a prime. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Uh, fucking underground weird small punk venue. It's not like it's not Wembley, but it's still fucking massive. No, I mean, I I've got ADHD, so it's very much uh, a release. It's like a place where I've been growing up, getting told off for like fitting and whatnot. I can just do whatever I want with my stage, my songs. I can just jump about, and everyone respects me for it. Yeah. And it's it's nice. It's just a bit of, I get a bit of like freedom, a bit of happiness. Like it's one thing like playing music that's really fun, but when you realise that everybody's enjoying it, you hype everybody up and everybody hypes you up. It's a massive like release of energy. We're like singing along to some of our songs. Mm. We're like we're like six, seven hours away from where we live. We don't get our sleep because we have to like travel a lot. And then we're playing all night because we want to look cool. We'll go out <laughs> as well. We go out with the people that we meet, and then by going out with the people that we meet, we get more connections. And then when we get more connections, we get we start traveling a lot again. And then we go out all night. And and obviously it's it's, it's great. It's fun, but it is very tiring. Tiring, yeah. But. Oh, there's no downside for me, I'm just <laughs> <laughs> come to a show and we play half an hour on stage. But then there's the like months and like years behind that. We only formed as a band because our friends were looking and it were full bands to support them. We played once and then we said, why don't we just sing together? Because it was so fun. It wasn't like we were trying to be anything serious, it was just like, we'll just do this for this one time. And yeah. We just realised how much fun we had. So. We were originally called Skate 3, but yeah, but 3, 6, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And really, I didn't even play bass until yeah. we started. We did our first gig. It was a set up, just people were like, oh, there's music. There's no albums. People wanted to do stuff. And then our, our second gig, a, a coach pulled up for people from the mountains and shit. And we were like, what the fuck is that? Yeah. And yeah, it was just not a coach since.